What's up today, my fellow Madden soldiers? So what I'm going to be doing right now is another Dallas Cowboy theme team update. So without further ado, let's go ahead and get right into it. So lately, I've been doing nothing but 50 out of 50 Dallas Cowboy theme team updates. And the reason why is because a lot of you guys have been enjoying it. So that's why I've been doing a lot of those. However, it's been a while since I did an all Dallas Cowboy theme team update with just only Cowboy players. So that's what I'm going to be doing right here. You see right here, we're 98 overall, 98 offense. 97 defense i upgraded this team tremendously there's so many players that i didn't even know there weren't even a lineup no more they got upgrades so we're gonna go ahead and go through this team we're gonna see what players we still do need and what players that we can hold off on for a while because uh, a lot of them already got upgrades so anyways this is the squad right here look at this offense right here as you as you guys already know it's a 98 right but if we actually had a 99 overall fullback our team will be a 99 overall on offense just with Cowboy players. However, we don't even have a fullback in the game, so I have to actually make substitutions in order to get us a fullback. Even though he is a, da a Dallas Cowboy player, he is not at that position as you see right here is Mike Dicka, and he's the highest player that we got put at that position for fullback. Um, a for a while, I had Billy Joe Dupree. I think he only went up to like a 95 overall, but with Mike Dicka, he went up to a 97 overall. But this squad is actually going down. Look at we got Cameron Irving all the way up to a 99. We got Larry Allen all the way up to a 99. We got Tyler Bayadas, 99, Zach Martin, Leo Collins, Blake Jarwin. All our tight ends are gooned out. Last year, I don't remember. I think we may have got some tight ends, but I know for a bit, for quite a while in several matches, we weren't getting a lot of tight ends. So I'm glad this year we got a lot of tight ends. I don't think last year we got a lot of tight ends. I don't even know if we even got major uh, updates. I forgot. I haven't looked at my team for a while. But the thing is, this year, we're gooned out when it comes to tight ends. So our whole offense is looking good, right? We don't even have to get a fullback. The fullback will be just, just to add them to and if, um, just to add it to the squad if they were to actually release one. Especially a legendary Dallas Cowboy fullback would actually be nice. I doubt EA is going to release it because if they would, they probably would have did it already. But if they do, I'll, I'll definitely be happy about it because we could definitely use them. But I don't see them doing it. So we could go. We could basically use Mike Dicker the rest of the season if we have to. But for those who don't know how to fulfill that position and get the highest overall for that fullback just for a Cowboy theme team, this is how you do it. Get Mike Dicker, fully power him up. Add him, add him as a backup. As you see right here, Adam, I, I, I added him as a backup at tight end and then I add him as our starter at fullback so he keeps all the cowboy cam and he's also up to a 97 overall we also got maxed out Dak Prescott which he also takes all of my abilities but it's worth it though because we got to make sure that our QB is able to get the ball to the receivers so I'll, I wanted to make sure that I max him out but let's go ahead and I'm going to show you guys what I actually have on Dak Prescott all right so what I put on him is bazooka Long range dead eye, identifier, hot route master, and escape artist. And the reason why I put identifier on him, I could have left it on my lineman, but I was like, you know what? Why not? I go ahead and put it on Dak Prescott and keep everything on him. And because he gets the Madden Machine, you see right here, he gets Madden Machine special Kims. So he boosts up, was it the wide receivers, the O line, and running backs. That's why our O line was able to get juiced up the way it was. And here's his attributes on the Dallas Cowboy theme team. 93 speed, 97 throw power, 98 acceleration, 95 mid, 98 deep, 95 throw under pressure, 99 throw under run, and 96 play action. All right, so yeah, he's going out. Now, now we got Ezekiel Alley, which is also fully gooned out. I don't know if you guys tuned in for the 50 out of 50, but I'm going to act like you guys did it and go over these players for you. And also stay tuned because I'm going to go over the strategy cards that I have on this team so you can see why my old line is up to a 99, right? If you guys don't already know, I'm going to go ahead and make sure I show you guys. But is it, this Ezekiel Alley is fully gooned out. I have not used him yet. I will be doing a gameplay, so stay tuned for that. I just wanted to make sure I get this video out to you guys, but he is fully going down. He goes up to 97 speed. It would be nice for him to have 99 speed. They didn't give it to him, but it's fine though because he's still going to be a goon out there. Look at all his other attributes. 99 acceleration, 99 agility, 99 carry, 83 catching, 95 change of direction, 96 trucking, and 99 break tackle. So this card is actually insane. It's actually insane. 99 stamina. 
99 jumping, which gives him that leapfrog. 96 spin, 99 juke. So this card is, look at 99 break tackle. So definitely we're about to make some plays with him. I was told that he fumbles it a lot. I don't know yet. I haven't played with him, but we're about to find out when we go online and uh, do a gameplay with him. We also picked up this Michael Urban, which he's now 99 gold. And he got 99 speed, 99 jumping, 98 catching, 98 catching traffic, 99 spectacular, 98 short route, 95 medium route, and 95 deep route. So this card itself is insane. Look at 95 spin and 99 juke, 98 catching traffic, and 98 break tackle. Wow. And 99 spectacular. All right. So this is the, the actual squad. Like I said, a lot of these teams got even even Amari Cooper got upgraded. It's been that long. He's got an upgrade. I think he's been had an upgrade for several weeks already. But it's been a while since I actually did an update to this full all Dallas Cowboy theme team. And he wasn't even on the squad. Now he's back on the squad because he has a 99 goal. But if we did have a 99 fullback, our whole team, our whole offense would be a 99 overall. All right. So the new upgrades that we got on defense is J. Ron Kirsch, Charles Haley. Um, Charles Haley for this uh, all Cowboy te uh, theme team. Let me see. I think Deion Sanders already had that time. We got the full Randy Gregory now. Ed Two Tall Jones is new. So it's been that long since I actually did an all Cowboy theme team update. It's because of all the other ones were 50 out of 50. And then we also got the full version of Michael Parsons finally, right? Yes, I got the limited for Michael Parsons and Randy Gregory because later on when they go down to about 100k and less i go ahead and quick quick sell the limited edition and purchase those and i'll still be able to come up on some coins so that's what that's the way i like to do it but this j ron curse once again it's been a while since i did game did, did a gameplay but i haven't i haven't even been able to use this card but i can't wait to use it but i put lurker on him and also acrobat and he also gets free safety as a secondary secondary position if you guys want to use them as that but look at his stats though, 98 speed, 99 acceleration, 93 tackle, 87 play rec, Eight, uh, 96 man, 96 zone, 99 hit power. So look at his stats for man and zone. That is very, very good for a safety. So this card is about to be goonish. His speed will go up to 99 speed if I actually put strategy cards for uh, DBs. But uh, I don't, I actually got them for like my linebackers and stuff like that. So he comes in at 6'4", 87 awareness, 99 jumping, 92 stamina, 95 change of direction. You see, 99 hit power, which I think I already said, 89 press, even the press for a safety, that's insane. So this is actually pretty good. So this car is actually all groomed out. All right, so the other one is Charles Haley that we actually added. The other ones were, you know, they've been in game, I just added the, the full version of them, but we'll go ahead and I'll show you guys what I put on Charles Haley. And then after this, I'm going to show you guys the strategy cards that I use on my squad. I put fear monger, unpredictable and under pressure because one of you guys recommended it to me. And then th look at his stats. So 97 speed, 95 acceleration, 99 strength, 96 tackle, 99 play rec, 99 block shed, 99 power move, 97 finesse move. 99 strength, 99 awareness, 91 jumping, 97 stamina, 89 change of direction, 99 hit power. So his man is doing all that, but he's more of a pass rusher. So that's what it comes down to. So that's what we're going to use him as. But I might also use Rome also. I mean, we'll see. Because sometimes I, I actually use her my linebackers, whether the middle linebacker, left outside linebacker, right outside linebacker. Sometimes I use them and I get pretty successful at times with them. All right, so this is the actual full defense right here. We're gooned out. The only other players that I'll say that we're missing is we could have the full 99 gold, Demarcus Lawrence. He really didn't make a difference. Later on when he goes down, I'll pick him up. And we could also get the full version of Everson Griffin. So, like, once again, later on when they go down, I'll get him right now. It's not really a big thing because our team is good enough as it is. But besides that, our team is good. We could use a free safety. Hopefully, they give us an upgrade soon. Once they do, you know, I'll be able to go ahead and pick them up. I'm waiting on the golden tickets, too. For what I know, they got three Cowboys, and I will be picking up all of them. That's why I'm stacking up my coins and preparing for that. So, these are our special teams. We got Randall Cunningham as our punter and Nick Folk as our kicker. So, let's go ahead and go to the strategy cards. For our strategy cards, I got paved the way, which is a rare card, which boosted up the whole line. 
and then I also got another rare card which is for all positions on offense and it boosts up everybody on offense but because it's zone run it focuses a lot on the linemen and the, and the halfbacks because you know there are a lot of them are the blockers but it also applies to every other player but mostly those are boosted up because you know they're the linemen blocking and then uh, it, ha it also helps out the halfback. Then on defense, we got heavy blitz. Um, and these are these both these cards are uncommon. We got heavy blitz, and we also got bull rush, which uh, helps out the DNs, defensive tackles, and outside linebackers. And this heavy blitz is heavy blitz is for the whole defense. However, a lot of a lot of the squad that mainly affects is the actual DNs, defensive tackles, defensive tackles, and outside linebackers. It affects other parts of the squad too, but those are the main ones that actually boost it up. That's why you see them at such a high overall, which we'll go back and you'll see. So when I put those strategy cards in on defense, um, Damian Wilson goes up to a 98, Lathan Vandress goes up to a 98, Jay Ratliff goes up to a 97, Malik Collins go up to a 93. If I take them out, these two go to a 97, Jay Ratliff I think goes up to a 95, and Malik Collins will go up to like a 91 or 92. So with those strategy cards, it actually boosts them up try, uh, quite tremendously. And for my visuals, if you guys want to see, it's very important that you guys have all Cowboys if you, got, if you guys want to get the complete cam because they add to the Dallas Cowboy cam. As you see, you go over here, we got 60 out of 50. That's why I also run a 50 out of 50 Cowboy theme team because I'm, I could put other players in that are non-Cowboys because I'm already getting the most out of the team as long as I had the 50 out of 50. But once again, this is the all cowboy theme team. But for those who are struggling to get those extra, you know, chemistries, make sure you have the uniforms coach and stadium in because they actually contribute to the chemistry. So if you guys want to know that. All right. So there it is there. This is the full Dallas Cowboy theme team. This is all cowboy players, all gooned out. The best players that I could possibly think that I could use for this squad. That works for me. I could go ahead and pick up a few other players, but I, I don't see the significance behind it. Our team is already going out. The only position right now that I say that we're lacking tremendously on is a free safety. We can use some defensive tackles and also a fullback if they, if they want to put it. The fullback could be at the end, but free safety first and then defensive tackles and then full fullback if they want to add. And then the other positions, they could go ahead and add them later, continue to build upon this team if they want to. But I'm happy with this team, man. We're continuing to build it. I mean, this team is getting more gooned out. It's possible we might get this to a 99 overall, just all Cowboy theme team. But I know a 98 for sure. But for the 50 out of 50, we will have a 99 overall. So we're doing that little by little. But anyways, there it is there. If you guys like seeing what we're seeing, drop a like on the video. If you guys need subs, sub to the channel. There will be more great, amazing content coming your way. Thank you guys all for tuning in. I'm out.